so much for security vetting, notorious prankster who handed Theresa May her P45 during party conference speech was issued with a pass in his own name. A notorious prankster made a mockery of security and embarrassed police today after giving Theresa May a P45 during the biggest speech of her political life. Simon Brodkin, 40, better known by his TV persona Lee Nelson, handed Mrs. May her termination of employment and yelled, Boris Johnson made me do it as he was dragged from the Manchester Conference Hall. He was arrested and put in cuffs only to be released minutes later when police saw he had an official pass in his own name and had already been vetted by them and the Tories. The Prime Minister looked startled as he gave her the P45 saying, Boris asked me to give this to you before turning to the Foreign Secretary with his thumbs up telling him, Boris, job done mate. The stunt marred Mrs. May's make-or-break speech and afterwards she couldn't stop coughing and needed large gulps of water and throat lozenges to get through it. Brodkin's latest prank exposed lax security as he was able to be within touching distance of Mrs. May and the entire cabinet for at least 20 seconds before being grabbed. It also raises serious questions for Greater Manchester Police, who were in charge of policing the event and vetting delegates, and the Met who take responsibility for the Prime Minister's personal security. There were also calls for Tory party chairman Sir Patrick McCullough to resign over the unprecedented security blunder and Amber Rudd was asked by the BBC afterwards, what if the P45 was asked? While Brexit Secretary David Davis called the breach extraordinary. Home Secretary Amber Rudd said she was very disappointed about the security breach. I am going to continue to follow what's going on, it's in the hands of the police and we will make sure we look carefully into how it happened to make sure it doesn't again," she told BBC Radio 4's PM. The Foreign Secretary's ambitions and loyalty to Mrs May has dominated the Tory conference and overshadowed the Prime Minister's speech, which went so were I. Brodkin was booed by delegates as he was taken away and yelled repeatedly. Boris Johnson made me do it and Boris has left me in the lurch. Around the same time, a tweet from his official Twitter account appeared, saying, Hi at Boris Johnson, I gave Teresa her P45 just like you asked. The P45 he handed to the Prime Minister gave the reason for termination as, neither strong or stable. We're a bit worried about Jezza. He was put in cuffs arrested and put in the back of a police van outside the conference venue before being released. Chief Superintendent John O'Hare said, earlier today a man was detained by conference security during the Prime Minister's speech. Officers attended and the man was arrested to prevent a breach of the peace and was released a short time later. The man had legitimate accreditation which granted him access to the conference site. In light of this we will be reviewing the accreditation process with the Conservative Party. Even with accreditation, everyone at the conference goes through airport-style searches before being allowed entry to the site. The Met Police run Theresa May's security and they will also be reviewing what happened. 